All right, welcome to Into. My name is Andrew, and we're here at Chillout Christian School to see what teens like you like to do. Let's go check it out. All right, so here I am. I'm with Sierra. She's a senior here at Chillout Christian High. And uh, so what are some things you like to do, like on weekends, weeknights, with your friends? On weekends, I spend a lot of time with my friends, just kind of hanging out. And we watch movies and you guys go play to the games. Or no, just... usually we just watch them at my house or something. We go to the park a lot. Um, there's one down the street from my house. Cool. And just different ones. And we like to go to Taco Truck, get stuff to eat, take right. it to the park. Right. Uh, one of my friends, I kind of like to go, like, um, we go, like to go midnight bowling a lot. Cool, cool. We usually go to Fun Works or um, uh, Boomers. Boomers. Because we're kids like that. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I think we need something like more entertainment to do than just the movies. I like to hang out at House of Java, that's fun. Um, or just sit at home, listen to music, go on the computer. Just kind of do your own thing. Yeah. Cool, cool. Yep. Thanks for being with us here at N2 now. We'll catch you guys later. All right, so we're here in Modesto at the newly remodeled Maddox Youth Center, where there's a full basketball court, a weight room, a reading room, and even a computer lab. Now, there's always all kinds of events going on here for boys and girls of all ages, and the best part is it's all for free. But we've heard a lot about the PAL boxing program, so let's go on in and see what it's all about. Hey, Officer Crawford. Hey, how you doing? Doing pretty good. Yourself? Yeah, not too bad. So what's this PAL program all about? Well, you know what it's about is it's sponsored by the Medicine Police Department, Police Athletic League. And what that is, it's after school programs yeah. to give kids and teenagers stuff to do in so the city I can of come, I can come here and do this. It's totally free? free of charge. You come down yeah. and we just get you going. Yeah. Um, you like a lot of different sports? Yeah, football, boxing, soccer. Hey, we got all that available yeah. plus other sports. Uh, all right. Have you ever boxed before? Uh, no, not like this. Want to give it a try? Yeah, sure. Hey, this young man just came in. Found out about the PAL program. How I'd you like doing? To give it a try Jordan? today. My name's Andrew, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. You, you too. want to try it out, huh? Yeah, sure. Yeah. You got the heart for it? I think I got the heart for it. Tough game. Yeah, I know, I've heard. Never done it before. No, sir. Okay, let's, let's, go, let's go for it. Let's do it. Okay, once you get on the bag and do the bag exactly the way you, you do, exactly the way you do it when you're chatterboxing. There you go. No bounce, no bounce. Walk around the bag. Just one time. There you go. One time. There you go. Out of boy. Keep it up. Keep the glove on the side of your face so you can block punches. Right. Not in front of your face. Straight right hand, okay? okay. Put your body into it. Okay. Close. Yep. Keep on doing it. There you go. A little bit better. Okay. But twist your whole body into it. Okay. Far so good, let's see what we got next. Hey, so, uh, so why are you doing the jump rope? What's it gonna help you with in the ring? Mm -hmm. Well, it just kind of helps you get your grip and well, like your legs and stuff. You kind of get moving with the quick feet and stuff? Yeah, just do a slide Sounds around. Good. What is doing right now, wrong now? Is not lifting his leg high enough. So you try to get the full exercise, and in order to do that, it's almost like you're running. When you pick your legs up higher, I used to hit my chest with my leg, don't believe that though. But when you bring your chest up to higher, you bring your chest the more you get out of the exercise. In boxing, you lead with your left hand at all times. Okay. You don't box with your hands open. Okay. You can break your hands that way. So always keep your hands closed when you're trying to box. Right. There you go. Don't lay down and lean in when you're throwing the right okay. hand. Okay. Some guy be waiting. You're leaning in, some guy gonna hit you on the knee with it. Right. Stand straight up when you're throwing it in there. One of the most advanced boxers. Sure I'm not here to speed back. It's for your speed. You keep your eyes, sharp your eyes on the street. All right. Okay? All right. Yeah. That means you keep your eye on the, on the focus point, focus your eyes on the back, All right. and your speed will build up as you go along. Right. Sounds good, man. These guys really know what they're doing over here. 
sound, looks like a real cool place, so let's see what we got next here. This is the mitts. All right. We're going exercise is going to work your upper body and right. your stamina okay. for your arms and stuff. The POW boxing so, program has been happening in Modesto one. since 1993, teaching young kids fundamentals in boxing and learning life skills like hard work and determination. The POW program even hosts large boxing exhibitions right here at the Maddox Youth Center. These events attract people from all over Northern California. The Intune cameras were rolling at one of these exhibitions and caught some amazing action. Go to school, get a good education, come here, get a good, tough mind yeah. education. Have some fun while, have you some fun while you're doing it. Yeah, Boxes right. are no good if you're not going to have no fun. Yeah, definitely. Don't box for anyone but yourself. So this is what these kids are doing every day. This place is open. It's for free. It's for boys and girls. And I just realized that uh, this is a great place to be. You learn a lot of good uh, lifelong lessons. You get a family kind of feeling over here. So uh, I'm going to get back to my training. You guys should definitely check it out. One, two, three. We know most of you and your friends go to the movies seeing all the great new releases, but right here in Modesto, we are fortunate to have an independent theater that shows everything from new releases to old classics, independent films to foreign language movies. Not only that, they hold concerts and performances here too. This place is beautifully restored and offers a unique experience you just can't get at a giant movieplex.